you doing? No, I just don't. I want to make sure you are okay. I haven't been like that all week. I don't know what you're talking about. Are you talking about me and you at the time at the park? You were there and then I showed up. And yes, I was walking home. I decided to see you then. Yes, of course. Well, it's only a matter of time until something bad happens to you. You never know. That's why I, you're the best friends I've ever known. I have to make sure you're safe, at least. Hmm. <laughs> Yes, of course. You sure you don't have to make sure that you're safe? There was one time you almost got hit by a car and I had to save you. That wasn't a coincidence. There was that one time you almost got robbed. Yeah, that was me. I had to save you then, too. How many times do I have to save you, though? I don't really care how many times. As long as you're safe, I'm fine with that. No, you won't be fine. Someone's going to have to keep an eye on you. And that's going to be me. Nobody else. Well, um, the thing is, Even almost avoiding me a little bit. Why is that? Just two weeks ago, for almost that two weeks, um, you've been saying you're busy. Are you really busy? Hmm. Well, I mean, can't argue with that. Are you sure you weren't that busy? Why have you been talking to Midoriya then? You guys are just friends, right? Okay, good. Just want to make sure that there's nothing going on. You and Bago aren't talking, right? That's good. Um, that's, uh, how is he doing? Oh, okay, that's good. But why have you been talking to other boys lately? No, 
was just that I've heard that you've been talking to other boys. It's not like it wasn't stalking you at all. No, it wasn't stalking you. Of course not. What's wrong? You seem nervous about something. Why am I making you nervous? What am I doing wrong? You sure? Okay then. Just be careful out there. And don't talk to too much boys. There are some boys that just like to talk to you I'm mostly into trouble. So just make sure you be careful. Okay? You know something. I just realized that we've been friends for a long time. I don't even know where you live yet. Oh. You forgot your address. You've been living there for a long time. How can you forget your address? You're not lying to me, are you? I'm just making sure. Well then. I guess we can go now. I'll see you tomorrow. Hi. I'm sorry. I needed to do this. So hold on a second. Hmm. It was hot in here, so I had to at least get some heat on. Not heat. I know when it's hot. If anything, I know it's hot in here to make it cold. What am I doing in here, you ask? <sighs> I had to follow you home. Yes. I had to follow you home.
because I'm not letting you go. I cannot let you go like this. Talking over boys that I don't even know. I was forced to do this. I had to do this. I'm tired. I'm tired of you talking to other boys. The only boy you should talk to is me. Don't be scared. Stop. Don't be scared. I'm not going to hurt you. you talking over boys and yes I was stalking the whole time you're right about that that's how I knew that you were talking to Doria Bogdo and other boys and I can tell they didn't want to just be with you But really, I want to be with you. I don't want no one else being with you. It took me to this to just do this. I had to. Because I love you. I do. I just didn't know how to say it. Because I didn't feel like you felt the same way. But at this point. I knew I had to do something now. I had to take you. I had to have you. Because if I didn't, it would be too late for me. So I stopped you and I followed you back home. And now I'm sneaking into your house. And now I'm in your bed. Where are your parents? They're going to be gone for a long time, huh? Well, that gives us time to bond. I know you're blushing. I didn't mean it like that, but maybe we can do that too. But really, just the bond with each other. Because I love you. 
Don't you feel the same way? You don't. Why not? You should. No, 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 shh, don't scream, don't scream, this is a knife, just trying to give you a warning, what will happen if you just don't say yes, no, I've done a lot for you, you've done a lot for me, least thing you could do is just be with me. It's nighttime. Barely people are going to hear you, but if you scream, it'll be over. And I don't want to hurt you. I really don't want to. But if you keep forcing me to, then I might have no choice. No. Are you gonna be with me or not? Good, good, good. I'm glad you said yes. I didn't want you to do anything. Anything done is what I mean. So rules here is just don't talk to her boys. This is a relationship. A good one. So I just said yes. Trust me, you won't regret this relationship. Bodical wasn't good for you. For you. Neither was Deku. Nobody else. Just me. We've known each other for a long time. It's time that we take things up to the next level. You're still looking a little bit tired. I think it's time for you to go to sleep. Don't worry, I'm going to sleep with you. I'll protect you. You're just... Come close to me. Oh, the knife. Let me get rid of that, actually. Now, come close to me. There we go. You're safe with me. I promise. You won't regret it. And just go to sleep. I love you. It's an amazing thing that's ever happened. We'll bond together. Good night.